The difference between a narcissistic person as a child and now, three things, three things. Height, weight, and age. Don't be afraid of demonic spirits. Don't be afraid of demons. Don't be afraid of narcissistic people saying, yeah, I'm a demon time, I'm a demon, you know. What happens is we develop this sense of urgency to be strong, to be superior, to redo, to do a, have a do-over, to be better than when we were as a child. Most narcissistic people that are self-centered, egotistical, cocky, arrogant, became that way. They created this person. As a child, I sucked my thumb. I had my teeth stick out. I cried a lot, right? I got into a couple of fights. I was bullied by older people. Um, I wasn't really tough. I made myself this tough person. And so when you all see narcissistic people, you talk about demonic spirits, the demonic spirits only have the strength when you give it the strength. I gave my my demonic spirit strength by acting a certain way, by being a certain way, by thinking I was this person, which I wasn't. But I became this leader, this overbearing, this cocky, self-centered, egotistical person. I became this person and I grasped onto those traits, right? I grasped onto those ways, those feelings, those emotions. Then I started acting who I thought I could be. And life and women and the Navy allowed me to become the person who I thought I could be, which that wasn't me. And so my demonic spirits, spirits didn't have any like solid foundation. They weren't on st steady ground. They were on shaky ground, but nobody knew that but me, right? And the only time I was able to be demonic and be sure of myself and be like real strong in my evil ways and my evilness is when you, her, she, allowed me to do it. I always tell women, you all have the strength and the, the power to either raise a person up or bring them down, not in a negative way, but when they mistreat you, you have the power to turn the tables and and reverse the actions that they're putting on you. So the women that hurt me had the strength to hurt me because they knew who I was. They just didn't believe in my demonic spirits. They didn't give, give my demonic spirits any strength at all. So when a person has demonic spirits or they're demonic or they're real powerful about what they're doing and who they are, narcissistic people hope and wish. Narcissistic people hope and wish you believe in who they are. And when you do believe in who they are, you give them more confidence, right? You give them more arrogance. I'm not saying you do it on purpose, but you don't realize it, that you have the power and the ability to bring them up or bring them down, or you have their power and the ability to humble them. A lot of times you come into a relationship, you're not trying to humble a person. You want to get to know us, right? But you soon find, you were soon to find, find out that I needed to be humble. And so now you're looking around for help. You're looking for the first lady, the, the pastor, right? His father, his uncle, you're looking for help. And Leon is too far gone. And you fall in love to say, you know what? I can't just walk away. And so those demonic spirits, you, they scare you. You don't want Leon to get upset. You don't want Leon to get angry. So what do you do? You make yourself small and you accept who he is. And then Leon won't get any help. You know why? A lot of times, say for instance, I can, I can play football, play sports box. When my dad showed up, it was like, all right, cool. But when my mother showed up, that was the emotion turn up for me. When you stay in a, in a toxic person's life or a narcissistic person's life and you don't leave and you keep paying into them, you keep feeding them, you keep celebrating them, you give them that emotional turn up like their mother would. A lot of times narcissistic people lost their mom early on, so they don't know how to understand or connect to a woman. But you're there for that. And where you make a mistake at is you stay too long, you stay too wrong. And then once it starts to affect your health, it's going to affect affect your wealth and you give up and you lose out. So don't be afraid of those demonic spirits. Don't be afraid of narcissistic people when they get angry. The difference between them and that little kid is height, age, and weight. If they were a crybaby, a little punk, a little scaredy cat, as a little kid, they're the same way as a grown man. They just put on the front and they act. And as long as you accept that act, they're going to think that they need an Oscar and they deserve an Oscar. And that's what they do. All right, y'all have a great day.